Hi, this is Lars Hedenborg and Thomas Elrod. We've been selling real estate for over a decade. Our team has sold over 3,000 homes in the greater Charlotte region, and this is how we do it. What's up, greater Charlotte area real estate agents? This is Lars Hedenborg, co-founder of High Performance Real Estate Advisors and founder of Real Estate B-School. Um, I want to jump into a daily practice that we use on our team um, that really makes a difference in terms of just the culture of productivity and getting stuff done. And this is a simple tool that anyone can use really to double, triple uh, your productivity and just really know what, what you should be focusing on to get the outcome that you're looking for in your business. Let me share my screen real quick here. We call this our Dominate Your Day. So we call this our dominate your day. So this is a daily document that I want to challenge everyone that views this video. Um, take the challenge to use this document every working day for the next 30 days. Will you do it? I hear yeses. I, in my mind, I hear yeses. Uh, so print, uh, what, 20 of these out for the next 30 days, at least 20, right? Hopefully you're, you're, you know, you're putting in a good effort every work week. Uh, and this is going to help you structure what you focus on. Name, date, right, simple. I used to do five of these a week. I would just staple them together, put my name on all five of them, put the dates on all five, and I would keep a week at a time, and I'd put the old ones in a binder. Um, I've really focused on my productivity over the years. Um, there's a few sections here that I want to highlight. Let me grab a tool, um, spotlight here. First section, you can see the six, six steps here. I'll let you uh, read those are projects, right? If you want to move your business forward in a meaningful way, there should be things that you're working on. Maybe it's getting your SOI database together. Maybe it's, um, you know, sending out a, a client mailer or something like that. There's a lot of things to do to, uh, to be a successful real estate agent, right? So these are projects, the, the name of the projects and the next five steps that you need to do to move that project forward. This next section is probably the most important thing you'll ever do in your real estate career. This is where you're making a decision on how to time block your day for the top six must do money making activities for the day, right? Number one has to be new business development, right? At least a three hour time block every day. Number two is lead follow up, probably 60 minutes a day. Uh, number three could be a buyer, initial buyer consult, maybe four is a listing appointment, five could be you know, show homes to buyer A or, you know, things that are going to make you money today. And then you get these in your calendar, plan start time, plan stop, stop time. These top six should take about six hours of your day. And then down here are all the other things that come up during the day, the action item list, the things that have to get done, but maybe they're not as high on the list of priorities for making money. And then the challenge is every day, this is where you get this, this attitude of gratitude. Uh, it's to go big or go home. We go big. We begin and end our days in gratitude. Begin in gratitude. So every moment of every day, you're looking for things that you're grateful for. Little moments where it can be personal or professional, just the things that happen during the day that you're thankful for. And that's this process. Commit to it for 30 days and watch how productive you become. And then stack another 30 days on top of that. And then you know, you can watch everything change in your life. Go for a full 90 days, three months in a row, and then the next 90 days in your real estate business won't be anything like your last 90 days. So take me up on the challenge. Uh, I'd love to hear back on any success stories. Um, and the name of this blog, as we call it here, is just to be better Charlotte. So let's all work together to up the level of play in our industry, and let's be better, Charlotte. Until the next time, we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.